Hi, we players. So nice, so nice that you can join us. Today, I'm going to make, be making a junk journal. And I know I'm late to the party. I think wreck these journals have been going for a long time. I only saw one the other day on Patty's channel. And I thought, oh, I'm going to make my own. And I'm not going to look at, they come with prompts, but I don't think I'm going to use those prompts. The only prompt I think I'm going to use is the take this journal anywhere. So, and I think that's quite interesting. I think I envisage myself maybe taking it down to the sea and getting it all wet. I don't know. It could be a journey. And I am going to read the chat out to you lovely replayers. They're just coming in. They don't know what we're going to make yet. <laughs> There's Lynn. Good morning, Lynn. So nice to see you. Oh, and Dar. Good morning. There's young Freddie. Worn out after his walk. <laughs> There's Joni. Good morning, Joni. Joni's in Ohio. Oh, it's so lovely. It's early. Everybody here at the moment is from the States. You've got your coffee with you, I presume. Good morning, Sherry. Oh, so nice to see you. Oh, Heather, how are you? I really have had you on my heart. How, how's it going for you and your community? Yes. <laughs> Susan, hi. So nice to see you. <laughs> Really nice. Oh, I find the Mondays come round quite quickly. <laughs> when I said to Sam about making this journal, I'll explain more in a minute. He quickly ran upstairs for me and found me an Amazon envelope. Wasn't that wasn't that so sweet of him? <laughs> oh, oh, Abigail, good morning. Abigail's up there in Canada, aren't you? Still really early in Canada. I hear it's quite hot in Canada at the moment, Abigail. There's Janet. So nice to see you, Janet Kay. Hmm. Oh, your grocer. Oh, Amy's watching while grocery shopping. Amy, after your Instagram post, I can picture the town you live in now. What a lovely town, Amy. You had a you had a stall selling your amazing journals yes yes oh um replayers i'll read out the chat for you so you don't miss out and you the gentle listeners you can just even close your eyes or carry on with your work and i'll i'll make sure you hear everything things are much less stressful uh, for you says heather Oh, and there's still fires in other parts of Nova Scotia. And we know people in Nova Scotia, don't we? But you, I know you were hoping for rain over the weekend. Mm. Oh, it's today. Uh, yeah. So all hands on deck. Yes, yes. Oh, yes. Donna. Oh, good morning. So nice to see you. Yeah. Oh, how have you been caring for yourself during this time? Yeah, so hard. There's Sis. Good morning, Sis. So nice to see you. Oh, lovely. Come on in. Come on in. There's Darlene. I know when Amy gets home, when she's put the groceries away, she's probably going to sit at her desk and be a gentle listener and art along with us. There's Darlene. Oh, so nice to see you all. Oh, it really is. Let me just scooch that chat down there. There's Kim. Good morning, Kim. So nice to see you. <laughs> Come on in. Look, I've broken that already. I've been struggling to cut this envelope. <laughs> I'm just taking it slow. There's Jeannie. Oh, yes. Pets and snuggles for Freddie. He's a little dear, isn't he? We've been on our lovely walk already because, of course, it's two o'clock here. <laughs> oh, thank you, sis. Oh, sis, you told us your name last week. And look at me. I wrote it down. I meant to just check. Um, Fanny, 
Your name is Fanny. That's just such a pretty name. I do hope I'm pronouncing it right. <laughs> I'm glad you can be here. Oh, there's Barbara. Good morning, Barbara. So nice to see you. Oh, come on in. Come on in. We've been, um, some of us meet up in other people's chats, don't we? There's Cheryl. Good morning, Cheryl. Oh, that's lovely. Kisses for Freddie, says Sis. Oh, that's lovely. Mm. Oh, Beth. It's, it is nice. Beth M. It is nice to have gentle starts to the day. I do that often. Yes, yes. There's Kathy. Good morning, Kathy. So nice to see you. Oh, Cheryl, I'm making another journal. <laughs> I can't resist. Oh, there's Caroline. Caroline popped a video out today. I'm not, I've watched it, but I'm not sure that I've commented yet, but I will go back and I'll be sharing it in the link below because you, you did the prompts. I know what I want to say, Caroline. I don't think I've written it yet, though. I loved watching you scrape that paint. Um, wow. Oh, drop your channel in now so people can nip and find you. Loved watching you. And the, the grassy colour. Oh, yes. It, it was lovely. You mixed it on the, on the page. Gorgeous. There's, oh, there's Sylvia. Oh, Sylvia. I'm going to link Sylvia's channel down below as well. Oh, do drop your link in, Sylvia. Um... Sylvia did, has been doing more pages in her caravan journal. Isn't that lovely? <laughs> There's Janet USA. We've got we've got three Janets in the house. That's so lovely. Oh, there's Kate. Good morning, Kate. Oh. And there's Kelly. Good morning, Kelly. Or as we say in the UK, good afternoon. These painty paper bits. What I'm you you might find what I'm doing quite slow, but because we have some wonderful gentle listeners and replayers here and people may be listening on their headphones, I'm tearing quite gently <laughs> so it doesn't make a huge sound. <laughs> and oh, if I do things slowly, I can take everybody in and... <laughs> it's more about being together, isn't it, I think? Yes, yes. Much less stressful, yes, for you at now. Yeah, oh, yes. I went back, Heather, just to check. I'd got all, all that. Oh, look, people are putting hearts in. The hearts are for everybody. Mm. Susan doesn't post much, but you have been doing the doing the um, prompts. Oh, Susan, there's never any pressure to post things. Sometimes we just want to do these things for ourselves, don't we, as well? Definitely. I think I show most of what I make, but I think I, I, I don't... Yes... I'm not, when I share it, I'm not saying, oh gosh, this is amazing. I, I might share something that, yes, you know what I'm trying to say. Mm. Oh, Heather, we are off to St. Ives in three weeks' time. Don't worry. The family, this will be the third time that I will have streamed from St. Ives. The family know. Oh, and then... It was St. Ives, and then where did we go last year? It was somewhere different, wasn't it? And it was a wider family holiday, and they weren't so used to me streaming. And so we were all set up. There was Katie and myself at the end of the table. But then people came in. It was a huge, long table with lots of people, and they were having their lunch and chatting. And <laughs> here we go. And and I, I just... Oh, I'm just about to start the streaming. Oh, it's so funny. <laughs> hmm. Oh, Jeannie, you had a blast. 
on your birthday on Friday, let me go back. Yes, I might have missed everything. <laughs> oh dear. If I do miss what you're saying, that look, I'm going right back. And I'm literally, I'm going right back. It's, oh, <laughs> there's me chatting away, chatting away. Ah, oh, Janice, good morning. Always so nice to start the week off with one another. Oh, my phone went somewhere. Gosh, I don't know where my phone is. Oh, it's over there. I'm going to get that because people might be messaging me to help me with the stream. Yes, Jodie Ann. Thank you. I will. I've scrolled back down. Thank you, Jodie Ann. Uh, that's Little Pickles. <laughs> um, oh, thank you, Lynn. Mm. They're Patty. Patty, do you know what I'm making? I have. I've explained to the wee players. I haven't explained. I watched your book haul. If you want a treat, oh, Patty, um, would you drop the link in for your visit to the book barn? Um, in in Patty's comments. You you described it as heaven on earth. I said to Sam, I found somewhere in the States, I love the States, that I want to visit. I want to visit the book barn. Well, Patty found a wreck this journal. So I'm making my own today. <laughs> and the only prompt I'm going to use is take this journal anywhere. <laughs> now let me go down here. Dannon, hi, so nice to see you. Oh, come on in. And there's Penny from Florida. Must be getting quite warm in Florida, Penny. So nice to see you. I'll get there. I've scrolled right back. Yes. Mm. Oh, love. Yes, Kelly, I said good afternoon to you. Mm. There we are. Let me catch up. Lovely Nashua. Oh, sending you love, Nashua. Mm. Oh, there's lovely Gail. Oh, Gail. Gail went out for a walk, didn't you, with Obi? And I, oh, I was so pleased when I heard that you, you'd done that. That was so lovely. Mm. Oh, yes, you loved the prompt. I think, haven't you given me that prompt? All you need is love. Or did I put it in thinking you would like that prompt? Caroline loves the Beatles, don't you? I'm getting there. I'm scrolling down, scrolling down. And there's Raul. Good morning. So nice to see you. <laughs> well, um, I would explain more later, darling. Um, let me just, yes. <laughs> Michaela, Michaela, good morning. Welcome, welcome. Welcome to the live. So nice to see you. Ah, oh. oh, there we are. Jeannie said she had a, such a blast on her birthday on Friday, visiting a small local museum and planetarium. Highly recommend seeking those spots out. And Jeannie, sometimes we can, if we can't get to places, we could go on a virtual tour, couldn't we? Mm. Oh, I'm glad you had a lovely time. It's lovely to get out and about sometimes or go on virtual tours. Here's lovely Pickles, little Pickles with her quote. I'm way back, but don't worry, I'll catch up. There's Harmony, oh, Harmony. I love your creations. Nip to Harmony's channel, pop it in. <laughs> oh, yes, Elvin and I went for a couple of walks now. Oh, that's fantastic. Regina, good morning. So nice to see you. Mm. Ah, oh, Heather, you're, you're popping in when you can. Yes, you're popping your head over the fence. That's really lovely. Have I caught up now? Let me read Little, little Pickles. Good morning. And thank you for sending that to me. That means that I can write it down for people too. You're sharing that with all of us, aren't you? When you can't find the sunshine, be the sunshine. And that isn't always easy, is it? But Jody Ann Little Pickles doesn't share these quotes lightly. 
Um, they wish they're shared from our heart. Thank you. Thank you, little pickles. When you can't find the sunshine, be the sunshine. Oh, that's a wonderful quote for today, isn't it? Absolutely wonderful. Thank you. Mm. Oh, you, Heather is planning on doing some Halifax walks in the summer. Yes, God. So I'm, darling, in answer to your question, if I've missed something, do, um, mm. oh, Regina's helping me. Oh, thank you. You saw Melissa Sue. Oh, wonderful. You know, thank you, Regina. You know that I don't like to miss people. Hi, Melissa Sue. <laughs> I'm making, I'm late to the party. I was just explaining to the replayers. I'm late to the party. I've never heard of wreck this journal until I saw Patty go to the book barn and buy one. So I thought, oh, I'm going to make my own. <laughs> and it said one of the prompts is take this journal anywhere. So that's what I'm going to do. It will come on holiday with me. <laughs> oh. And Helen, Helen. Helen L, good morning. So nice to see you. It's very hot with you, Barbara, isn't it? I know. Mm. Oh, I got, I like to say, this is a junk journal, so I've saved the flower, the flower packets. I always, this one's little, I always find that they have such beautiful pictures on, nice thick paper. Because this is a wreck, this journal, and I'm presuming it's going to be dipped, I'm not going to follow any prompts. I'm not going to look at pictures of the original ones. I, I'm get, I, I envisage dipping it in muddy puddles, maybe. I haven't got, yeah, no, no set plans yet, but, <laughs> or dipping it in a rock pool and seeing what happens. <laughs> Caroline, good morning. Caroline H. We've got two Canadians in. Hmm. Oh, yes. Regina, um, Melissa Sue did do a lovely video, didn't she? Yes, I can link that below of, of the happy mail. That was so kind of you, Melissa Sue. <laughs> oh. Yes. You're doing some collaging. Yes. Don't you worry. I'll try and read the chat out while you do some collaging, Heather. Heather, it's wonderful. Don't you find art, our art, does help during times like this? Definitely. It's, it's a piece in the storm. Oh, especially doing things like this. Making a junk journal. Has anyone else made a wreck this journal? Or bought one and used it? Because I was looking quickly back on, on um, videos just to see. I don't want to be too influenced. I wasn't watching. Oh, that was when Karen came and was showing us the plans for for our for her extension. That's fun. <laughs> so we'll pop that in. Oh, so nice to see you. Now, Headless Violin, I think you're Chris, aren't you? But I, I did write it down. Oh, it's written in my other stream notes. Oh, what am I like? <laughs> I'm hoping it's Chris. Good morning, Chris. <laughs> There's Becky. Good morning, Becky. I'm so glad that um, Scott had a nice birthday. <laughs> oh, Pam and Pusscat. And Pamela B. Pamela B. I saw you higher up there. Clocked it in my mind and didn't say hello. Good morning. <laughs> oh, and Kathy D. You're all, oh, Cheryl's telling me your, your next journal is to paint, your next step is to paint your mushroom journal. Oh, what fun, what fun. Oh, you and Patty 
I'm doing the mushroom journal. Oh, Janice, Betsy Doodle has done a wreck this journal. Thank you. Oh, thank you, Janice. What I'm doing for my DIY wreck this journal is I'm using quite strong paper. And I'm, because I think it's going to go through, not literally the mill, I'm going to send it through the post. And I know that I'm going to dip it in rock pools and see what happens. And won't it be wonderful just to have something to experiment? And even if it goes, how can it go wrong? It can't, it can just evolve, but you know what I mean. I'll still show you, that's what I mean. Have I missed anyone yet? Oh, let me just go back and check that, check that I'm getting everybody. But I know everybody's so lovely and we help one another. There's Miriam. Hmm. It's, Cheryl, yes, it's going to be reckless. Yes, yes, because we do approach our journals, don't we? And we like to place things, however relaxed we feel. Yes, a little bit reckless, whatever that means, Cheryl. I, I'm not sure. Do you know when gel prints, the colours don't quite work for you, you're not that sure brilliant for a junk journal <laughs> oh, mm. oh maria i missed maria good night 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 sleep tight oh sleep well i missed you coming in oh and but good night sleep well and we'll chat in comments and oh yes yes i'm going to share some of our ideas, Maria, as well. <laughs> hmm. Yes, da, they do. I, 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 when Patty was showing hers, they give ideas of how, what to do, wrinkle the pages. I think for me, da, what I'm going to do is just take the prompt, take this anywhere, and I'm just going to see how it feels. I'm wondering whether when I take it with me, whether I will ask other people to add things in. And yes, yes, I'm going to see how it feels. Hmm. I'm just collecting together papers. These, my, these are my drop sheets. Hmm. Have I, am I missing? If, if I've missed you and you've come in, just say, Janet, say hello to me. There's Amy. Good morning, Amy. Oh, Amy, you've been doing doing a prompt page. I will link that below as well because it gives people an idea of um, different ways to use the prompts. Yes, or not to use the prompts that we do later. I know that I'm missing someone and they came in and they had a sunshine in their name. But they ah, oh, and now I've lost you. If you want to come in again and say hi, that would be absolutely wonderful. I'm sure you put a little sunshine. Mm. Oh, Michaelia. <laughs> and it's your first live. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I'm so pleased that you could come in. It, yes, it's not easy, is it, entering into a live? I remember my first live. Um, let me interrupt myself. Nidia, it was you. You came in with sunshine, didn't you? And I want to say hi to you. <laughs> so nice to see you. Mm. Didn't we have a nice time at yours, Miriam? Mm. Now, what was I saying? I interrupted myself. <laughs> Uh, oh, yes, the original Wreck This Journal, and you can get it second hand as well. And mine is going to be a DIY one. 
Yes, I think is that enough pages? Sometimes you have to stop and you have to say enough's enough, Janet. <laughs> basically, basically, it, my one is a junk journal, and the wreck this journal is a journal with prompts, isn't it? Mm. <laughs> oh dear. Oh yes, you did a little frog, didn't you, on a surfboard? It was absolutely. Absolutely adorable, <laughs> Amy. Absolutely adorable. Hmm. Now, I'm sort of caught up, but I'm hoping I'm not missing anybody. So I'm going to so might wreck this journal up. And then I'll explain some other thoughts I've had on it. I'm going to use the pamphlet stitch. <laughs> I think it's I think it's nice and strong. And because I don't think this, well, unless you had an industrial sewing machine, it wouldn't go through this because this is Amazon card. Hmm. We had a lovely time celebrating Miriam um, yesterday afternoon had You, you've, you've got, I'm just looking here, you've got 200 subscribers, so congratulations, congratulations. There's Marty, good morning, Marty. So nice to see you. Come on in, come on in. Come on in and rest a while. If you'd like to rest, there's a lovely chair over there that's just all ready for you. Hmm. Let's get Grandpa's Hall with a gorgeous wooden handle. Isn't it lovely to have that connection with the past and use the tools? I'm coming back here because I know that I've missed Jean. Jean's here. You're drift, you're here, but you're you're drifty this morning. You were up all night, so can't follow the chat. Jean, don't worry, I'll follow it for you. And as well, the whole screen is designed so you can just relax and fall back to sleep as well. Definitely. Mm. Kaz, hi, so nice to see you. <laughs> so nice to see you. I'm glad you're visiting. <laughs> I like to have lots of visitors. I've got lots of comfy chairs. So I'm using the old yellow pages there and you pop it in the pop it there of course i'm just doing one signature you know me and then i get my thread will it be longer i don't sure it's what's on there and you go up through the middle and janet b hi janet so we've got three or four janets in the house now i love it <laughs> oh janet's genies jean and, and janice's <laughs> we've got the jays mm. oh heather heather's done a oh that didn't come through that hole that is fine there we are just make sure your fingers are out of the way and push it into the spine of this catalogue. There we are. And it's quite sharp, so we'll put it somewhere. Do we still, do you know, I'm, I've got a feeling they don't. I think maybe this was the last one and I thought, oh, I will save it because it's the last one. But of course, they're so handy to use, aren't they? And I think their paper's quite delicious as painty paper, but... It makes a good spine. We have the yellow pages online now, don't we? There's Pam. Good evening, Pam. I'm just making a junk journal, Pam. Um, I haven't clipped it on, so I'm just I'm just winging it really. Um, there we are. Now, did that? Did that? That hole never went through. Right. Let's try again. This is lovely. Oh, now Anne Lair may be in the background. She's not well, but I know that Anne will be waiting to see if I've done anything upside down. 
<laughs> and get well soon. Mm. Oh, Kimberly, good morning. Mm. You're shaking in your bed. It's cold. It's winter, isn't it, in Australia? You need another duvet on or a, a nice quilt, don't you? Mm. Have you got any homemade ones? Mm. Yes, that's right, Kaz. We met on walk, the Walking Channel, Blackburn. It, oh, what, what channel is it, Kaz? Oh, um, Rebecca recommended it. I, I shared it in last week's, one of last week's videos. A lovely walking channel up north. Beautiful channel. Hmm. Come to me in a minute. There's Sandy. Good morning, Sandy. <laughs> oh, so nice to see you all. Mm. Oh, you've got, oh, yes. Oh, do you know I missed that trolley? <laughs> oh, dear. There's Marty coming round with lovely, healthy snacks and bunches of flowers. It's very hard to get through. So I've made it nice and strong, this journal. There you go. Nice, strong paper. There we are. That got it. That got it. Kathy D, I'm sure I said good morning to you, but just in case, I'm going to say good morning again. <laughs> Thank you for handing everything out. Marty, you, you're very busy with the trolley. But it magically fills up, I'm sure, <laughs> for everybody that wants refills. And mm. Oh, yeah, Marty does doodling and zentangling. So then you put it through the middle hole. Of course, I'm making I'm making quite the deal of this today. But no, that's fine. Push that through. It is a lot easier than I'm making it. I think it's because um, I'm, it's because it's very thick card. There we are. And then pull that through there. And the first thing I do is I put the needle back. It's not like me, is it? And then I put that in there. And I, yes, it doesn't usually get lost then. It's nice and safe. <laughs> oh, good morning, sister. Oh, Afro sister. Good morning. I'm so glad you're popping in. So nice to see you. So nice to see you. Is that wibbly wobbly? No, there we are. This is my reckless journal. <laughs> Wreck this journal. There we are. So there it is. That's the beginnings of it. And I don't think I've left it here. What I'm going to do, I'm going to put an address label on here and I'm going to tie some string around it and I'm going to post it to myself. That's the first thing I'm going to do. And then when it comes back, oh, I didn't put the cloth page in. Oh, well, never mind. Um, I can maybe I can maybe add it when it comes back i'm going to put a hole there and i've got this pencil case here so i'm going to take it at its word and take it everywhere i go not everywhere but i'm going to take it with me i'm just going back happy maker is carol oh i'm glad i'm going back because <laughs> I'm missing you coming in. Good morning, Carol. And there's Susan. Oh, there's Susan and her fairy, Lo. There are. Oh, is Lo watching? Oh, and Lynn has a fairy too, Lily. Oh, it's so lovely to see you all. That's Kimberly. Oh, so nice to see you. Hmm. Kimberly, I, I apologize if I've missed you before. And Barbara G. Oh, Barbara G. Yes, yes, you made it. Oh, I'm so glad. And I know life is so busy for you, isn't it? I know. So, ah, oh, you've arrived. And I hope that you'll be able to spend 
even if it's a little while, a gentle time with us. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I'm making a journal here, but mostly, mostly we're chatting. Let me know if I miss you. And I know that everybody's so wonderful and welcoming here. Ah, oh, let, me, let me go up here. Susan M from Maryland. Susan, did we meet the other day in Shannon's? Ah, oh, yes. Thank you, Janet. I, Janet B, I do hope you're doing well. Ah, oh, hmm, hmm. So yes, have I? Am I caught up? Or let me know if I'm not. Let me know. <laughs> ah, Kelly's saying hi to all the Janets. Mm. No, you didn't. Oh, Susan, Susan M. Welcome, welcome to the live. I'm so glad that you found our our. Our lovely space today. Meet Freddie. He's having his little snooze over there. He's really snoozing. Hi, Irene. So nice to see you. Really nice to see you. I trust that slowly but surely you are healing. Mm. There's Rada. Good morning. So nice to see you. Mm. Yeah. Marty. Yes, Marty's a bit headachey, so she's given us all our snacks. Thank you, Marty. There is, a, I wish I could turn the camera now, but it just might fall off if I start to try doing that. Your chair is just there, definitely. Mm. Yes, you go and have a nice rest. <laughs> There's Angie. Oh, so nice to see you, Angie, because Angie may be quietly in the background, too, because it's not easy for you to type. You're looking after your hand, but you said it's healing, healing well. Hmm. So I'm going to tie up this string. Oh, yes. When it, so when the journal comes back, I'm going to make a hole and I'm going to pin this pencil case to it. But when I take this journal around in my bag, this is my, oh, there's the string. This is my wreck this journal. And Cheryl said, I'm going to be reckless with it. So along the way, this is what I found over the weekend. I may find little charms and bits of treasure along the way. I'll definitely want to carry a glue stick. And I'm wondering whether the best pen this journal is going to be a sharpie so i will be putting other things in but that's the basic kit so that will hook on there through a hole but for the minute it's going to have string around it because when i go off to deliver the happy mail i will I will um, post this back to myself. So it's just a half journey. <laughs> oh, there's Lisa. Lisa, did I miss you before? Lisa, oh, there's Lisa. Lisa snuggled up, I wonder, with her dog. Um, yes. Carol, definitely. It's good for sending good vibes up to Marty for her head. She's over there gently mm, listening. She's in that lovely comfy chair <laughs> with all the cushions on. There's Stephanie G. Good morning. We are some lovely string. Um, Kelsey, Kelly, was this string? It's very beautiful and fine. Was that on my happy mail from you? I will incorporate it back into this journal once once it comes back from being posted. Has anybody, I know sometimes people post themselves postcards. Has anybody else posted themselves a journal? Hmm. Dream with Caroline says I could post it to her and then pass it on. Oh, do you know, I would love to do that. But our mail is so slow. Yes. It would be lovely. They, they call those round robin journals, don't they? There we are. A proper label. 
on it. I've got a white label here. Hmm. You don't think it was you? Not sure. Kelly, no, no pressure. Yes, I just pop that there. Where would be the front? Let's, let's put a label on. So you don't have to do, we don't have, where, oh, the glue's in here. <laughs> hmm. Janet's offering coffee to people. Hmm. Yes, hidden vibes, yes. Hmm. Yes, oh, Sherry. <laughs> oh. So nice to see you, Stephanie G. Love to you and the family. I'm wondering, you, um, your, your little one is on holiday now. It's, it's the summer holidays in, because our children have got another five weeks before they go back, um, before the uh, summer holidays. Mm. These are a few of my favourite things. <laughs> oh, there we are. So I've put an address label on, so that can go and get... Where, where should I put it so I remember? I'll pop, pop it there. <laughs> a community jerk journal would be amazing instead of a whole journal being posted you just make a page and one person puts the journal together yes Let, let's little pickles never say never let's think about how we could do that and postage takes a long time but and if it got lost it got lost it would get lost and I know what you mean little pickles Hmm. And even if we're still sat here in two years' time, <laughs> and it gets, yeah. Hmm. Oh, yes. Yeah. Lisa, doing inner child things. Do you know, I think that's why I like putting the happy mail together and doing the prompts, because doing the prompts is just like I've got my my book out and my little pencil tin out and doing the happy mail it's just like i'm playing post offices all over again i think do you know we with our art lisa aren't we we're just it's it's our inner child isn't it definitely so definitely so oh yes hmm. Oh, Carol, I know. Yeah, they, they are awful, aren't they? Definitely. Mm. Oh, little pickles. Yeah, but they bring me a lot of joy to make. I don't know whether you... Wait, what video is this on? I, I don't know. Oh, I was making the Fabric Flow journal and I, I made a spare one. And I, I have done the slow stitching on it. So this is fabric and it's Mod Podged or PVA'd onto deli paper or for us in England, greaseproof paper. I've done some slow stitching. So it's Mod Podge on the bottom, but there's no Mod Podge on the top. So it feels nice. So what I'm going to do is turn that over because I stuck my other one straight to, where is that one? You know when you cut, I put it somewhere safe. You know when you put things somewhere safe? Um, I stuck that straight to a box, didn't I? Anyway. Things just turn up. I never stress about looking for things because they'll just turn up. Mm, Ashley. Yes, Ashley. Good morning. You love to let your inner child come out and play in your journals. It's so true, isn't it? Because they can be just for you. I don't mind sharing things with you, but yeah, definitely. Definitely. Let's get some bits of napkin. And what I'm going to do, I'm making, this is like a master board. I'm going to be making some journals. That's a journal cover there. And I'm not sure what the rest is going to be. 
But let's, let's create and let me show you. And create on the back too. Let, don't let me miss anything. Hmm. Oh, there's Sandy and look, it's some headache advice. And yes, I know. Hmm. I know. It's not easy, is it? Hmm. Oh, Cheryl. <laughs> oh, hmm. Oh, you love sequins. How lovely. They're lovely to add to our slow stitch. Oh, look, let's pour the glue in, the glue on here. And I'm going to spread it out like this. This is joyful, isn't it? Oh, I'm sort of committed now to... Oh, I suppose I could just let the glue dry, couldn't I? There we are. that and just rip up the napkins. Oh, lovely. Make sure they haven't got the backs on. Has that got the back on? No. Is that a gorgeous one? That was from Maria in Australia. Comes all the way from Australia. Isn't that gorgeous? And just, oh, I will put some glue on the top here. Basically, I think we're making this this part is making paper fabric, but of course we've got some real fabric on this side and some gold leaf. I can put some gold leaf on this side too. And then we can add some tissue paper as well. Tearing and ripping paper. Mm. Yes, it does, doesn't it? It's lovely to have shiny things in, in different ways, isn't it, Cheryl? Definitely. Mm. Oh, lovely. The tissue paper's gorgeous. Oh, it would be nice with some very thin book paper. Have I got any? I haven't got very thin, but I've got some. Let me tear this gently. I love the summer break too, Stephanie. I love it when when you've got them at home. Mm. Yes, learning to be more independent. I remember mine at that stage, Stephanie, getting up, making their own egg bread. And yes, yes, you go through phases of making their own lunch. And oh, it's lovely. Precious times, precious times. We played lots of board games too. And I think that's lovely because the boys still love, and I do, still love to play board games. Yeah. Mm. Um, Susan says, uh, you tell yourself that it's only wasted if you don't get, it doesn't get used. Ah, oh, yes. Just putting some book paper there. Because it's lovely when the book paper shows through, isn't it? It's going a bit, this is an experiment. I haven't done this before. Have I done this before? Some, I know, but I bet someone says, no, Janet, you've done this before. <laughs> I don't remember doing it before. It's going a bit wrinkly, but I could iron it, couldn't I? I'm not going to iron my clothes. But I, I don't mind on this side. If you put like a cloth over it so you don't get things stuck on your, the gold stuck on your iron, you could. Mm. I don't always remember, Jana. I try to. And sometimes I write people's names on things as well. I do try. Yes. Oh, lovely. It is going quite wrinkly, but... Do you know, isn't life an experiment? If we didn't try things, we'd never know. Oh, what a dear little bird. I know this one is from Cat. Ooh, if you haven't caught up on Cat Han's latest video, who's seen it? Oh, let me, um, I'll link, make a link. She, uh, Cat's doing her nature journal, but she's got some bird cam pictures. Oh, Joyful. Mm. 
absolutely wonderful. Is this bluey? It won't hurt to add a bit more. Hmm. Oh, there's a loose thread there. We'll just leave that in, I think. I'm going to put that bird there. Because there's some going to be journal covers, but the others might become tags or ATCs with a double side. I'm not sure yet. <laughs> that's that one. Oh, that's got a lovely little wishing flower on there. Oh, mm, it'd be a shame not to use that. Let's, let's use that little piece. I'm just throwing things in the bin there. And they those papers then go into the recycling. Hmm. Oh, we we don't mind Taiwanese, do we? That's what Beth says. <laughs> I'm smoothing this book page out a bit. Lovely. Put that little wishing flower just there. Oh, lovely. And this will be wonderful to come in splash paint, put a bit of gold. The world is our oyster. Karen W, there's me. <laughs> Karen's W's been making lots of fairies. Oh, they're so fun, aren't they? Me too, Karen. I've been, I drew another little one. Oh, I'll show you in a minute. Mm. Oh, Gail saw Kat's video. I know, the bird cam is amazing. I think you're all going to love it. <laughs> Oh. Hmm. I'm just reading, sorry, there was silence there, I was just reading. <laughs> oh. Caroline on the hillside says that she can't stop making fairies, mushrooms and flowers. Oh, seriously, seriously. Just before we went live, I was making some more flowers. I was sorting out my my mushroom making folder. Oh, I know. It's the little phase we're in, isn't it? <laughs> Let me just add just something there and there before we move on. Oh, this is a lovely one. The nice thing about this is it can use up our bits and pieces. Oh, this is William Morris. Oh, you see, Janet B, I can't remember who sent me this one, but it is very precious and I love it. Mm, lovely. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Now, can I find that fabric flow so you can see the cover? Let me get up now. Scraping that chair. Oh, here it is. See, there's the other cover I did. There's Cat. Oh, Cat, we were just saying about your wonderful video. We loved it. <laughs> and if people haven't caught up, uh, we're going to leave a link so they can see your lovely journal and your, your bird cam and other little insects in the, <laughs> in the gar um, animals, I mean, in the garden. Oh, Barbara G, you, you're still here. That's so lovely. You're having a, a little few moments with us today, aren't you? Which is lovely. Mm. Oh. You've been pruning your roses and listening. Oh, that's lovely. Sending Beth M, sending a bouquet of roses and fresh mint. How wonderful, Beth. How wonderful. Mm. So, yes, this was the fabric flow I made. So this was the leftover. So this one's going to be quite a, it's going to be quite a floppy journal cover. Sometimes that's nice, isn't it, to have a soft journal cover. Ah, so this was the fabric flow. I'm, I'm, I'm sure you've all seen it. Um, but I would like to send this on its travels. There's Beth. And we've got Beth. We've got another Beth. We've got Beth McKee, who's pruning her roses and, and giving us roses and mint. And we've got lovely Beth Schuler from Florida here. <laughs> so nice to see you. 
Come on in, Bear. <laughs> Beth, meet Beth. Oh, there's Inkpole. Good morning. So nice. You've been working and listening. Oh, yes. Oh, the lovely gentle listeners in the background. That's so lovely. <laughs> oh, wonderful. Wonderful. And I loved all the pages and flips and flops and watching you put in washi tapes. And it was lovely. A super video cat. Hmm. I would like to send this journal on its travels. It's the flow journal. And the person who wins it, I shall discuss what fabric they would like to go inside. And then, of course, they will be adding their own fabrics. So do you want to put numbers in here? And I will send, I'll be able to send the fabric flow to somebody, if that's what you would like. Pop numbers in for yourself. And then also pop numbers in for other people, as many as you like, because it's lovely to send people, send people happy mail. There we are, lots of numbers coming in. That's super, super. Mm. Yes, that's lovely. So the whole idea, there's Kelly S. Good morning. I'm so glad you're here, Kelly. It's <laughs> so nice to see you. <laughs> Oh, yeah, the whole idea is you could set it up for a project and have all your fabrics in there. And then you just you can have it on your desk or take it to the lounge or take it on the train. Maybe Sylvia's put a number in for Julia. Thank you. Julia isn't with us this morning. Um, she had an appointment. So we're sending her love. Mm. Sending love to all those that are precious to us that can't be here this morning. Mm. That's it. Lovely popping numbers in. Mm. Janice, you take care. Did you put your nine and three quarters in? <laughs> take care. Janice is off to work. Safe journey. And we might see you when you're there. <laughs> Kelly, yes. Hi. Mm. Yes, between one and 150. And then I pick a number on random number generator and it's the nearest on or under so we probably don't want double numbers for this because i've only got one to send off so yes <laughs> if we do have double it'll be the first person to put it in oh gems yeah oh one for janice johnson thank you thank you sylvia thank you um becky it does get hard putting numbers in oh susan says ashley yes oh no i know we're putting a number in for happy mail and i send some happy mail usually it's a tiny little envelope but today i just thought i have a fabric flow from that melanie gave me so i would in turn now like to pass on a fabric flow to someone it's just a way of finding who to send the happy mail to <laughs> ashley and welcome <laughs> so nice to see you ashley i'll put this over there it's it's coming on it's got some nice so it's it's like that on the front and the back the inside cover is going to be like that once it's dry it will become quite fabric like i think <laughs> that's the mm. right there we are shall i generate a number now oh carol says eight for canadian artist carol i know who you mean thank you yes yes thank you Mm. Oh, Harmony's cat already picked 150. That's so funny. <laughs> it's getting everybody involved today. Now, where did the lid go? Oh, you know, you can't find the lid. You know what the lid says? It's from Jam. It says spread joy. <laughs> Isn't that lovely? Mm. You're listening while fold folding clothes and hanging clothes and uh, and housework stuff. Oh, I know, darling. We do have to do that sometimes. Mm. Beth McKee for Sweet Elizabeth. Oh, Beth for Lizzie Brewer. Or, or for 
Elizabeth, never fearless by Elizabeth. I think it's it never fearless by Elizabeth. Oh, yes, yes. How lovely. Oh, generate a number. Of course, you've got to remember that I have this huge lag here. Mm. So let me go to number generator. Oh, let me just read the quote out that I put in the title today. Be kind to your body, gentle with your mind, and patient with your heart. Be kind to your body, gentle with your mind, and patient with your heart. Hmm. Yeah, never hopeless by Elizabeth. I know. Oh, she's lovely. Oh, dear. Oh, adulting. I know. We've all got to do it, haven't we? I know. We'd rather be playing, wouldn't we? Hmm. Random number generator. So I go in here and I put a number between 150. So I'm going to do that and I'm going to generate the number. And it's 94. So the person on or nearest under 94. And this is the stage where I have to ask everybody to help me because um, Butterfly Creations, good morning. So nice to see you. I'm going to get a little post-it note so I can put the name on. Hmm. There we are. That said, I don't need to, so <laughs> well, it would be nice to have a collection. You could make yours if you wanted to make more. You could actually have a collection of them. Mm. I know. Thank you, Lisa. It's a very gentle quote. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Oh, I know. I know. Um, Beth, Beth, um, mm. Oh, no. Regina's just got back. Oh, we'll do another number thing in a minute, Regina. Um, yes, gosh, it, it's, it's frustrating when that happens. Mm. Oh, um, Kathy C would love to send Ashley happy mail. That's super. 89 is the nearest, the Caroline on the hillside. And of course, because I've made it, it is a little bit wonky and wobbly. You know what I'm like and a little bit bendy in the middle, but it's made with love. Mm. Caroline on the hillside. So thank you. I will send I will have a discussion with Caroline to see what fabric she'd like me to put inside. But I'll send that in the post. <laughs> All the way to Canada. That's so lovely. <laughs> Ashley's Ashley's in Georgia. How lovely. Mm. Oh, <laughs> and Kellyanne. Oh, how lovely. We're getting the happy mail vibes going here. That's so lovely. Sending happy mail to one another. Happy mail always arrives at the right time and nothing in return is ever expected either. Mm. How lovely. We'll have a little discussion and you can tell me what colour fabrics that you'd like me to include. Yes, Barbara, it is, Mrs. Oh, it is. Thank you. See, see how teamwork makes the dream work, doesn't it? Thank you. I'm surprised young Freddie isn't reminding me. It is Mrs. Teapot's time. You're right. Thank you. <laughs> oh, dear, let's do that. I'll go and get, I'll go and get the snacks. Mm. It's a time... I, I, our lovely Marty will have fallen asleep, hopefully, in the chair. Oh, I didn't bring. Oh, I am going to go and get the milk. Would you? I got the milk jugs out here. I will go to the kitchen to get the milk. We do like our tea with milk over here in Britain. And hold that thought for a minute because I'm just going to give young Freddie. Scoop your legs over a bit, young Freddie. 
아니고요. 네, 그렇지. Everybody will remind me. Oh, how lovely. <laughs> hmm. Oh, there we are. Right, what am I what am I up to? Flask, tea, snack. <laughs> because seriously, I do it now in the middle of the stream because you know you've arrived, you're here. If if you were to come to the house, the first thing I would do would be to uh, to offer you a cup of tea or beverage of your choice. I don't have that many soft drinks. <laughs> oh, Beth and Ashley, are you exchanging or sending happy mail? Beth sends lovely happy mail. That's so kind of you. <laughs> Oh, so glad you can be here, Kelly. Yes. Mm. That's lovely. Thank you for reminding me. I went off into my own little world there, didn't I? <laughs> yeah, let's pour myself a nice cup of tea. How lovely. I've got the milk. And I know I'm not going to eat now because I didn't want to sort of choke and talk with my mouth full. But I've got here. Soon as the stream finishes, I've got myself here. I'm going old school. I used to do this with the children. A nice little honey sandwich. I thought I thought you used to think, oh, it's sweet, but it's quite healthy. Mm. Oh, Sophie. Um, Sophia is is Amy's dog, so that's so lovely. Oh, Pam, dear, I did say good morning to you, didn't I? I do hope I did. <laughs> so nice to see you. Mm. Oh, yes, it would be. It would be. And yes, I mean, I never share anyone's address without their permission. But if you want to get in contact with me, I can always get in contact with that person because I communicate with quite a few people here. So and then I, we can exchange addresses that way. Does that make any sense? Cheryl's going to the table. It's time for Cheryl to start creating. Hmm. Oh, yes. And, and if you're on Facebook, our lovely Beth here in chat has a lovely Facebook group. And they send, send, send happy mail together, don't you, Beth, dear? I don't know whether you feel comfortable to share that here, Beth. Um, hmm. Oh, thank you. So into mushrooms at the moment, Karen. It's, I don't know what it is. It's the fairy tale side of it. Now, Amy is here, but she can't type in probably because I, knowing our Amy, her hands are full of paint. <laughs> She's splashing paint as we see. <laughs> hmm. Oh, Heather says, having people to mail treasures to has really got my creativity going and you love it. Oh, that's lovely, Helen. Uh, Heather, that's lovely. Hmm. Yes, you could look one another up on Facebook or I can help you find people. Mm. <laughs> so lovely you can be here, Nydia. So lovely. Mm. Let me just close this pop up that's come there. So what have I been doing this week? I have been I've been making um painting little toucans. <laughs> <laughs> I don't, oh, that's why I'm mentioning Amy, because it's, she will be linked below. Her, her channel is Okie Dokie Forest. And if you know me, I love toucans. But it's through watching Amy do her art. Oh, she is there. <laughs> we'll get back 
to your paint, Amy. I know that you're, you've got your hands full. She does her drawings on paper and then cuts them out. For some reason with me, that's really clicked because I'm not going to say I'm, the only reason I, I'm not, I wouldn't call myself good at drawing is because I haven't practiced. And just this, doing it on a separate paper and then sticking it on has, I don't know, I found it quite freeing. Thank you, Kimberly, for sharing that. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, there's our lovely Marty. <laughs> so, yes, I did this. And this little toucan says, live gently on the earth. And he's in my, my little teacup journal. So it made me want to just draw more. So they're all different. Oh, I think the other thing that has freed me is to think of things as being quirky and whimsical so it really doesn't matter if they're tails or wonky or it doesn't look like a toucan or because you think it's my toucan and yeah it's it's whimsical so I found that quite freeing oh there's Barbara thank you so much Barbara <laughs> Oh, Caroline, it just I hold the pen wistfully and yeah, it's just the very beginnings and I'm sharing it so just as, yes, just to encourage everyone. It's a very fine pen. It says here, 0.7. I know Amy um, Birdie said once to me, what pens do you use? I'd say, I usually use the ones that Ben leaves behind. <laughs> So that's that. Yeah, that's what I've been doing. I don't, what else have I got to show you this week? Maybe it's time to go on to our prompts. <laughs> so what we do at this stage in the proceedings, oh, what I do is I take, take this tea bag out. There, excuse my fingers. We have a saying, excuse fingers better than toes. I actually, I should have a spoon, but Senefe, put some milk in. Oh, now this is what we call a cuppa. Oh, yes, a nice cup of tea <laughs> with milk in. And that's how we like to drink our tea, a lot of us. Oh, Lazima, so nice to see you. Mmm, Lisa, they, um, because they're wispy, aren't they, Lisa? And it's, yes, there's no right or wrong. Let me show you. I took this to a little cafe in my notebook. But they, I was drawing a fairy and you do a face, oh, that doesn't look right. So I just drew another one. It's only a bit of paper. Emerson was in... In the comments, we chatted. Her favorite, Emerson's favorite hat on the fairy was a, um, the paint, the one with the paint palette. And I, I, I said to Emerson, oh, now what fairy hat would I wear? And I thought my fairy hat would be a basket. <laughs> and in the basket, I'd have all bits and pieces. I've got glue. I've got a cup of tea and a biscuit. I've got a paint palette and I've got a crochet hook and balls of wool. Prit stick. Oh, and a journal. It's very, very, um, <laughs> very rough. So, yes. <laughs> If you were a fairy, what hat would you wear? <laughs> oh. Good morning, Peter. It was nice to see you. Where did I see you yesterday? Was it in Miriam's? I think it was. So nice to see you. Freddie is Freddie in the basket. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> but his treats are. His treats are in the basket. Mm. If Freddie was a fairy dog and had to wear, we haven't, 
oh, I have done some pets because I did um, I did Beth Shuler's dogs with fairy wings on. <laughs> Susan Lee's fairy hat would be a book and a cat. <laughs> oh, that's lovely. Oh, wonderful. Sometimes you do carry your cats on your shoulder or your head, don't you? I know. Hmm. Oh, Butterfly Creations and Kathy are, are getting together there. That's so lovely. It would be like that if we, if we were literally in this room, we'd be having cups of tea, but we'd be exchanging contact details and wouldn't we we would hmm. if i was a fairy it would be a purple iris says dream with caroline have you got any of those in your garden caroline hmm. um uh, barbara oh it's so lovely to see you does thank you for your kind words does that mean you need to go now um, you have been able to spend quite a nice little bit of time with us today and I do hope that you feel a little bit more relaxed you've had a bit of time for yourself oh Safia okay yes and good afternoon mm. oh Caroline on the hillside yes you've got to go errands oh I know yeah and she says stay adventurous and stay fresh that's a lovely thing to say to us. Thank you so much. Mm. So here's my page from last week. Now, when we do, when I do, I pick six prompts. Whether I use them all or not, I don't know. I just use it as a jumping block, really. So I started off with a, a page and there was a rucksack. Was that, was that last week's? No, that wasn't last week's, that was the week before. What am I like? Oh, yes, I thought I'd show you that one. <laughs> oh, we did this one. We have the googly eyes. And I knocked on Julia's door. She lives next door to Ben. And she let me choose out of a jar some googly eyes. They're very splendid googly eyes, aren't they? <laughs> and... Here is my, as a wave, here is my puzzle piece with the positive quotes that you all shared. Mm. Take care, Caroline. Mm. Lisa Jane says, if you were a fairy, you think your basket would be tumbling items on. Um, too much inner child things in it. And a teapot. Oh, and a biscuit. And you're going to draw one. Fantastic, Lisa. <laughs> Tumbling and spilling out with things. Absolutely wonderful. Oh, thanks, Kat. Oh, dear. So my jigsaw piece. These are last week's quotes. Be gentle on yourself as you explore the unknown. No one has all the answers. That was our little pickles, wasn't it? Mm. Nature doesn't hurry, yet everything is accomplished. Oh, did you share that with us last week? I can't remember. Mm, it's, it's a lovely quote. Thank you. Nature doesn't hurry, yet everything is accomplished. Mm. Oh, let's have a breath. Mm. We're not going to hurry because this is our time just to create. And people are gently listening in the background. And oh. Now, I know what I would like to do before I start with my next page. I would like to light the candle. I'd like to light the candle for all those that are here. And all those that are gently listening in the background. And for the people that are in your hearts too. Mm. Oh, Melissa Sue made two fairy journals last week and this week a unicorn. It's lovely. Isn't it lovely? It's so it's 
they bring you so much joy, that sort of thing. Mm. Oh, that's lovely, Cheryl. She will treasure that. Mm. Sandy's been gently listening and doing some embroidery. Yeah, on journal tags. That's lovely. Mm. Take care. Take care. We're lighting the candle. We'll keep you in our hearts, um, little pickles. Mm. Take a breath. In a busy world, it's nice to have times of silence and slowing down. Mm. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Oh, Lisa, that's so lovely. <laughs> Lisa's quirky, that's so lovely. People have um, called me, especially when they see my house or garden, they've called me eclectic. Mm. That means maybe that there's quite a lot of stuff, I don't know. Mm. Mm. Beth, yes, we will keep him in our hearts. Let me write that down. Oh, yes. Where did my pen go, Beth? Oh, here. Mm. Oh, Beth, yes. He must be so on your in your heart and on your mind. Mm. Yeah. Oh, Regina, that's good. Mm. Let's find a new page. So when you do a magazine journal or any sort of altered book, you don't start at the beginning. You you go you go a little bit here and a little bit there throughout the journal, so the spine doesn't collapse and go wonky. Can I move your table? That flow. Are you all right? What have you been doing, darling? Oh, you're still making postcards. Have I knocked that postcard off you were making? You were making a heart-shaped postcard. Has that gone through fairy mail already? Hmm, interesting. <laughs> Flo loves making postcards. She really got into it now. Hmm. Ah, yes. Barb. And now, Barbara, you have to go. Mm. Yes. And, and Barbara's keeping people in prayers and in her heart. But she asked the same for herself too, for, for her hubby and herself. Yes. And yeah, life hasn't been kind lately. Barbara, I'm so glad you can join us. And you've got people here that really will be keeping you in their hearts definitely mm. take care take care Barbara Jo mm. mm. oh why have I got a saucer and some netting in my prompt box I don't know <laughs> I do <laughs> oh so let's pick some prompts and you can it's just a way to put pen to paper or glue to paper in a notebook, journal, postcard. You can do one of the prompts, none of them or all six. It's up to you. Mm. So many wonderful um, good wishes going there and prayers and hope for for our lovely Barbara, mm, Barbara G. Yes, yes. Mm. So lovely to see you. And we have um, another Barbara, Barbara E. And I would like you, if you're making notes, same for Barbara E, if you, if you wouldn't mind. Yes. Mm. 
Thanks, Kat. <laughs> Mm, thumbs up for you all. <laughs> We're a team, aren't we? I love it. Mm. Right, so I'm going to... Thank you, Susan. Oh, it's kind of you. Mm. Mm. Yes, prompt, says Caroline. Right. Oh, we had that one. Oh, I was going to write... I got it out to write something on the back and didn't. Hmm, well, I'll leave it there. Right, okay. One, two, I'm not looking. Three, it's always a three, four, five, six. It's always a surprise. It's nice to have a surprise. And I do enjoy, I do some with you. Mm. Oh, Marty, we didn't expect you to. Oh, Marty. Marty's come back in. I thought you were gently in the background, our lovely Marty. Thank you. Do help yourself from the trolley. Anything from the trolley, dear? <laughs> oh, butterfly. That's so lovely. I'm, I'm going to prepare my page. So with my magazine journal, I've got a link. Well, not link below, but I've got a magazine journal video and I did a little short just to say how I did it tear three pages out stick two together basically I'm going to draw so this is one of my pages that are stick two together and I'm going to cut out a hole in the middle because I was doing these last week wasn't I with the the ATCs and the teapot journal had a hole in the middle and I thought I don't know when this idea came to me I thought oh I'm going to make so you could make a journal page or I want to cut this out quite carefully because I would like to use the circle for something as well <laughs> thank you oh that's so lovely everybody is so lovely just, I'm just trying to make a little hole there, just so I can put my scissors through. Where's my two pages stuck together? There you go. <laughs> I'm going to cut that out because I think it might be nice to have a round tag. Or cut. I'm going to cut a hole out here. Mind my tea. Is Jean's probably gone back off to sleep, but Jean likes to know what mug of the day it is. I've got my lovely, so my lovely neighbour Sandra gave me that. It's got a pattern on the inside as well. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, Rebecca, I didn't expect to see you this morning. You must be exhausted. I popped in yesterday and I put a like on your sale, but it wasn't the sort of stream to chat in because people were buying things and so I just put my head around the door and Dana was helping you and then I noticed when I went back to comment that you streamed for six hours yesterday that's a marathon isn't it I thought you must be exhausted today oh wonderful so that's going to be nice. That'll make a nice round tag. Might be able to use that on the page. So I'm going to today create on this page and then I'm going to put the netting behind it when we finish. I'll make sure it's just the right size. I don't want to waste any of it. So eventually that window will look through to another another page. Are you? Am I explaining myself properly? I'll probably have to stick that down and stick two pages together. Will I? Maybe. I'll see what I have to do to do that. But I could. Yes. Is that clear as mud? So let's um. Pop some greaseproof paper under here. Did I, did I explain that right? So it's going to be a bit like this. 
oh, I've lost it now. But of course, because it's in a journal, you will see what's underneath that netting. And it, it will probably, it that will be on another prompts. Mm. You're pretty tired. I bet you are. Mm. You're not going to stream later. Yeah. Oh, you're going to be doing some more, uh, another sale. Yeah, okay, I get it. This afternoon. Yes, I understand. So if people want to go and join in that after the stream, yes. Hmm. Right, seasonal colour. Oh, how lovely. Seasonal colour. That's the first prompt. So on this page, see, I say seasonal colour because we're all from different places, aren't we? Hmm. Does it depend what you've got as well? Sometimes it's a case of use what you have. Seasonal colour. Hmm. We think of, we, we do think of yellow. But I can add some yellow. If I start putting some painty paper down, I can always add some yellow. Hmm. Yes, you have a nice rest until your stream. That's right, yes. So I'm going to tear some of these bits up here. Oh, so nice to see you, Nashua. So lovely. Mm. <laughs> Did his ears just perk up? It's not muddy, it's very dry here, Barbara. Um. The, we've got London clay where we are, so it's all it it's it goes into hard cracks with them holes all down. Yes, yeah. I'm putting some seasonal colour here. This is like an orangey colour, and I can come in later on and add some yellow. You can paint on your page. Oh, the other thing you could do is, if you wanted to do this, you could decorate your page with the background and then cut out your circle. So then the circle would be decorated. Oh, that's just a thought. <laughs> oh, Melissa Sue's just put the pot on to make a cuppa. Well done. Yes, yes. <laughs> That's great. If anybody would like a, another cuppa, um, Melissa Sue's just popped the kettle on. Hmm. Yeah. This is just a lovely way for us to just spend a little bit of time with one another. Now, with these magazine journals, I like things to go over the over the edges. So it's nice book paper. So that's what I'm doing. I'm taking off these creamy bits, the edges. Kathy W. Yes, yes. And some of us are in spring, some of us are in summer, and some of our friends are in Australia are, are just coming into their winter now, and it's very chilly for them in some parts, yes. Mm. Oh, Jeannie, I know, you don't, the phone keeps ringing, oh dear, so I'm going to go over the circle. So I'm going to break up that harsh line by putting some of these papers over it as well. I haven't got a set plan here, but um, there. So let me know if you, that's that. I've got some more in that color. That, oh, I, may, I know why, because I made the fish for last week's prompts with that, yes. So I could put this on, but I could come in with some, definitely come in with some yeah. 
there we are definitely coming with some yellow she, it, again lisa it's like our our inner child isn't it We're just ripping paper and gluing it on but it's amazing what a nice background it makes i think i might scrape some yellow paint on here but we'll see we'll see I'm having too much fun. Shall I read another prompt? Yes. Let's read. Oh, oh that's sorry, darling. Did that make you jump? That's the glue lid gone. Hmm. The next prompt is a journey. Journey. Oh, wow. Wonderful. That could be a destination or a form of transport. A ticket. Hmm. Journey. Hmm. Anybody going on a journey? Because, of course, it is your summer break in the States. So some of you may be going on journeys or visiting family. Oh, take care, cat. Yes, yes. You take care, cat. Yes. And your bird camera cam is absolutely wonderful. I'll leave a link in for that video so everybody can watch your lovely nature journal. <laughs> Take good care, cat. Thank you for coming in. Oh, it's lovely. Hmm. There. Well, I really have filled that up and I've enjoyed every minute of doing it actually. It'd be nice to scrape some yellow on there now. Journey. Anybody got any ideas for what they would do for journey? Hmm. Oh, Caroline picked up a Tim Hortons gift card to use for scraping paint. <laughs> and you're loving it. Oh, lovely. I loved watching you scrape the paint, making that green. That was wonderful. Ah, oh, wonderful. That will be linked below. You have to give me a bit of time to get my act together. But um, as soon as I can, I will put all those links in. Oh, that's, I really enjoyed that. I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do for journey. Sometimes I just let the prompt, I like to mull it over a bit. I'm very pleased with this background so far. And I've got some coming over the edge and some coming over the circle. Right, let's have another one because I'm mulling over journey. Mm. Oh, Gail, Gail has to go. You go off to physio. Yeah, hard work, the physio, and painful, but it seems to be really paying off. Oh, bye, Susan. Oh, I'm missing people here. I just looked down for one minute, don't I? Let me see. Susan R. Yeah. Oh, you take care. Mm. And you're going to catch up with the prompts later. Oh, yes. But no stress. No stress, Susan. You take care. It's been lovely to spend time with you. And take care, Gail. I hope you managed to get out for another walk as well. Mm. Yes, and we've got someone in our in our group called Journey. I could add some happy mail that Journey had sent me to this, couldn't I? Yes, let me have a let me mull that over. Sometimes when I'm out walking Freddie, oh I love to think about a page or a project and yes, yeah, things just um come to you don't you don't they the reason i turn it over is because we've used some of these before but this one's a new one tea bag tea bag hmm well have i got any tea bags because i will be oh dear now my secret's out here is my little pot of bits and pieces goodness me have i got a tea bag in here. I think I've used them. So I'm going to make a faux tea bag. What fun. Paper or I'm going to get what paper shall I use? 
them down here. Ah, oh, here we are. Going to... Somebody gave me this book and I've been enjoying using it. I need a rectangle of pattern. Oh, that's nice. Vintage linen. How lovely. Super. I'm going to make a faux tea bag. <laughs> Just in case you haven't got one, look at that cupboard with vintage linens in. Isn't that lovely? I'm not going to be using it all, so that would be nice for something else as well. So what you do is make a rectangle. You'd think I'd have a tea bag. Oh, use my tea bag. I've just taken one out. There, haven't I, Caroline? You'd think I'd have a tea bag or two, but you have to dry them, don't you? And I probably use them all on a journal and in, that, in my let's have a cup of tea journal. I had one the other day that I was painting on. Where's that gone? Let's get the happy mail out. Hmm. Yeah, you would think I'd have a tea bag or two, wouldn't you, Caroline? <laughs> I know, I know. Let's make a faux one. That's fun. So... Roughly, these are gorgeous. I've got these pieces for something else. Wonderful. Hmm. Roughly, when you make a tea bag, you fold it in half like this, and half it is they usually come out this big. And then, when I say half, I mean roughly, and it's like that, and then you fold it up. like this oh we've made these out of netting and then put beads inside didn't we then you fold it over like that and it's sort of like that isn't it so it's a, a rectangle and you fold it up oh that's cute let's let's some um, put a tag on let's sew it together shall we and put a tag on. There's Kerr. Oh, Kerr's coming to say hi to Freddy. <laughs> he does. Doesn't he look chill? Mm. Well, he has a nice long walk on it. Well, he has a nice long walk every day, but we just got back really from our walk. Yes. Mm. Yes, you set them on a paper towel. Yes. I, don't, I mean, I don't always, they go in the compost heap, my tea bags. So. What have I got here? Oh, let's have, I'm just picking things out of this little overflowing bitty pot. Who has, does anyone else have these sort of pots on their desk full of little bits and pieces? I've got like a, an oversized heart there. You know, the little dangly bit that comes down on your tea like that. But let's make an oversized one here. And then we can write a quote. Has anybody got a good quote for us to write down on here, on our tea bag? But you can use your tea bag however you like. And you can use it to dab and, where's that all? Let me find this. You could use it to dye your paper. I could have just used that one from, from my tea just to dab and make the paper dyed. Oh, I might do that actually. There we are. Beth, Beth M says, yes, she's got quite a few bits on her desk. Mm. Oh, Helen, you take care. Oh, no, you had to pop out and you hope, oh yeah. No, don't worry. Um. I'm glad you're back. Yes, yes. <laughs> oh, let me see. I'm missing people here. Hmm. Colleen B. Oh, you're popping in to say hi. Oh, that's so lovely. I know Mondays can be very busy, can't they? I appreciate you popping, popping in. It's like we're neighbours, isn't it? And you can just pop in before you go out. I love that. Hmm. Yes. 
Yeah, you take care. You yes, you've got a busy week. What was I? Oh yes, I've got my oversized tea bag tag here. Because things don't have to be like real and real size because we're going full whimsy, aren't we? Mm. You pop yours in. I put mine in a plastic container, Lynn, but that usually goes out to the compost heap. So it's only when I have like a little sesh of drying tea bags. There we are. Let's pop that there. And I put a little bit of glue there too. So that's ready to put. So I've got my faux tea bag here. That was just in case someone's a, a, a complete coffee drinker and hasn't got a tea bag. There we are. And I can put, I can put, go back. There we are. There's my faux tea bag. And with this oversized tab. And I can go back, let's pinch this together and decorate this. It'll have a saying on and it can have a picture on, but I'll leave that there. That's one of my prompts and I've got journey and another one. Oh, this was Kat. Kat sent, Melanie's sister painted that painting. Isn't it gorgeous? Isn't that wonderful? It was on a birthday card. So I changed it into a prompt card. Kat has given us a prompt and she says, use a recycled item. Something on your desk or not, doesn't have to be on your desk. A recycled item. Do you feel sometimes that most of the things on your desk are recycled items? I'm wondering whether I'm just going to take my little pot of bits and pieces and joy of joy, just collage some of these things down. I think that's what I'm going to do for that prompt. That's a lovely prompt. Thank you, Kat. Mm. I know, isn't it wonderful? It's got some silver in it too. What a lovely, wonderful, thoughtful card. Isn't that lovely? Mm. So yes. Oh, what's in there? Oh, got a little quirky bird. I'm just going to I'm just going to randomly put some things on. And later on I can be thinking, how do I make this a journey? The whole page could be a holiday. I'm not sure. And because it's got that hole in it, and it's going to have the netting there, it can lead on because the next page will might tie in as well. Hmm. <laughs> I know it is a wonderful landscape painting. Hopefully, Melanie may be on the replay. You should be able to show, show Marion. Yes. Mm -hmm. oh, lovely. Oh, postage stamps. That's a journey, isn't it? Do you know, sometimes I find that things come together. Yeah, it's like the fairy journal I made. I didn't intentionally mean it to be every, to all be about hats. It just happened that way. That's what we call serendipity, isn't it? And it was only when I was editing it, I thought, my goodness, it's all about hats. It's so, isn't it funny when that happens? Kerr, you say that, don't you? Hmm. Ah, oh, do we have another prompt? Because, yes. Oh, use a paintbrush. Use a paintbrush. That's a joy. And if you haven't got a paintbrush or you just don't want to use a paintbrush, you might want to use your fingers. Yes, you do that. Do some finger painting. <laughs> you be you. There's no set rules, is there? Oh, I'm finding myself putting lots of birds on this page. Hmm. Now, it's probably time for us to... I've got some happy mail here. 
that I'd like to send off. If you pop a number in between 1 and 150. Hmm. Oh, yes, yes. Oh, I know, Kerr. When, when um, real life just gets in the way of our creating, I, I do hope you get some little times to create this week, Kerr. Hmm. Hmm. Now, pop a number in for yourself and pop a number in for other people as well. Hmm. That's it. So I've got two envelopes here that I can send. I've got someone gave me a card ages ago and I it was an odd and I was gonna say odd, an unusual shape. So I I yes, pop some one in, yep. Yeah. One for mom. Oh, that's lovely, Becky. And other people, people that aren't here, can't be here. Yes, yes. Mm. And I, I drew round it. So I've got that envelope and that's from an old atlas and I've got the label there. Or I've got this envelope that I've, I've been making this for my Tuesday process video. It's not about envelopes. That was just on the side. I can't even think what it's about now. What am I making tomorrow? It'll come to me. Hmm. Oh, thank you, Barbara. Putting numbers in. Lovely for other people and yourself. And I'm loving that. So I can send one of these. Yes, for little pickles because she's gone. And Carol's putting one in for um, Canadian Carol. Locus, as we like to say, Locus mum. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Oh. So yes, I will send one of these little envelopes. I'm so totally focused on you, I can't think what I'm creating tomorrow. <laughs> What am I lied? Hmm. Hmm. Ink Pulp has been here before, and I, I can't remember your name, Ink Pulp. <laughs> and you're so welcome here. Oh, if I write it down. But you might like us just to call you that. Yes, yes. Hmm. Oh, Kerr, did you get your happy mouth? I absolutely love making it because Kerr and I have got different styles and you, you you're liking the dark fairy vibe and um I so enjoyed it it's lovely to have a different challenge isn't it she wrote <laughs> I'm so pleased mm. Mm. yeah that's what I just yeah, that is that's my inner child loving playing post offices <laughs> Ah, oh, Martha, hi. Do you want to pop a number in, Martha? Because we're just doing a, a little tiny happy mail giveaway here. Pop a number in between 1 and 150 or someone else can help you do that. So nice to see you, Martha. Mm. Mm. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, yes, that was such fun to make. Mm. So do set me challenges. Tell me what you like. <laughs> it, it's quite nice to have prompts or a challenge sometimes and then other times it's nice just to just to chill hmm. yes welcome welcome martha i'm going to generate a number i'll just wait a minute because that i have a lag and um people might be wanting to come in have we had all six prompts oh i'll read one more out I'll go over the prompts in a minute. Hmm. Are you ready for me? Oh, thank you, Barbara. Yes, yes. Hmm. Hmm. Lovely. Hmm. Right. Should we generate a number? Oh, yes, lots of top pictures. I know. Well, you've just done that video of what you liked, haven't you? Yeah, bless you. Mm. Oh, Butterfly Creations, you were the planner love to Butterfly Creations. 
And and now, yes, I need to write all that down. Or you, could you message me that? Could you message me on Instagram? Because you are on Instagram. And then I can get your name and your channel in my head. Thank you. Um, yes. And you, your, your Christian name. Yes, because we're on Instagram together. Oh, hi. <laughs> Let me generate the number. Number 24. Number 24. Mm. So, and then the person can choose which envelope they would like. And I'll put some happy mail in. I've got, I've been making some ATCs and bits and pieces. <laughs> it's just very small and very flat and goes through the post very nicely. Mm. What's happening? Oh. Oh, I like this one. I like this one, this prompt. So not only have we got a hole to peep through on this page, it says add a flap. Ooh. Oh, I can add that as a flap. Like a window. Oh, does that work? Oh, yes. Add a flap. Because mm, sometimes you have those on your journal and you flap out. Oh, hi, Trey. So nice to see you. Mm. Yesterday was your 26th high school graduation anniversary. Congratulations. How time flies, Trey. Mm. And you played your videotape of the ceremony. That's amazing. You graduated from 12th senior grade. Oh, that's your highest level. Congratulations. And it was in 1997. And that was that was a nice memory train yesterday to look back on that. Mm. Mm. Could anybody or oh, what number did I generate? I said 24. Can anybody go back and help me and tell me who had number 24? Because that really does help. Yeah, you're, we follow each other on Instagram. Just message me. Um, would you mind? And then I can try and get that in my head. And you graduated when you were 19. Oh, that, was, that was a lovely day for you. Mm. Sylvia D. Oh, Sylvia D. Now, Sylvia likes dragonflies and butterflies and is creating a gypsy caravan. Or is it a vintage caravan? Can't remember. So let's find a little post-it note. Um, and put Sylvia D mm, on there. Wonderful. Mm. Oh, I had the graduated in 1992. <laughs> oh. So let me read the prompts out. But what have I got the generator out? What I did was on one of my one of my videos, I took the comments and now I'm just going to just on one of the videos, I'm going to generate a number and send another little happy mail to one of the people that kindly chatted to me and all of us in the comments. And it's number 30 and that name was, oh no, that was the other week, this is this week, it's Beth, Beth Shula. Well, how lovely, I will send a happy mail to Beth Shula. How lovely, and that's for chat, chatting in the comments. Sometimes we have what we one would only describe as a thread, we get a conversation going, it's wonderful, I love it. <laughs> ah, let me read the prompts. So, yes, Sylvia, I will be sending happy mail out to you. <laughs> Something to go in your caravan journal. And also, um, no, I won't say just in case. Uh, um, I was going to say something else, but um, I changed my mind. Right. Seasonal colour. Journey. That's the one that's going to come to me. How am I going to interpret journey on this page? Where are we going to go through this round window? 
Oh, that's it. Yes. And tea bag. <laughs> it, I think Beth may have fallen off back to sleep again, but I'll let her know. And Kat said use recycled item. And then we had use a paintbrush. And then we had, oh, oh, this is amazing. Make an I am list. Interesting. This is like a positive affirming. So make a little list. It can just be one thing. You might be finding it too hard to do today. Don't try if it's too hard. So the I am, so it could be enough. I am discovering my inner child. I am. These are coming off the top of my head, so bear with. A good friend. I don't know why I wanted to say that, but I did. I, one tries, one tries. Yeah, that was just an example. So making an I am list. But it, you could write, I am going to come back to this tomorrow because I'm not feeling it. <laughs> making an I am list. Mm. Kimberly, you take care. Aunt Beck says, I am worthy. Yes, thank you. You are worthy. Thank you for helping me out there. And to, that's giving you people affirmation. Thank you. Mm. Yes, the babies. <laughs> it is a lovely mix of age groups. It's a family, a family atmosphere. That's so lovely. <laughs> Absolute pleasure, Sylvia. Right, so I'll give, I'm going to hop over here and give Freddie his goodbye treat. And then, <laughs> Lisa, I'm glad you, your journey got a crossroads sign with with areas on my page, LOL, L, and a pot of tea. Lisa, what a good idea. Oh, how amazing to have a crossroads sign. Oh, wow. Gosh. That's amazing. Mm, road signs. Gosh, amazing idea, Lisa. And of course, a teapot. Yes, of course. <laughs> mm. Oh, when we say tea, you just add coffee if that's what you drink. There you go, darling. Can you believe it's the end already? I just feel so relaxed. Oh, it's been lovely. Mm. Take a nice, gosh, deep breath as we go out. Ah, oh, into the week. Mmm. Take good care, take good care, Kathy. You're headed out to volunteer. Yeah, you take care, um, Kathy, and have a good day. Thank you for um for I, I got distracted. I was in the middle of a sentence and I distracted myself because Sylvia's put down, I am loved. We're giving you some. We're giving you some ideas. And maybe this is a good exercise because you might not feel these things. You might not feel worthy or loved. But just the practice of writing that on a list and maybe putting it in your journal, I think that would be brave. And you could write, I am brave. <laughs> mm. The great I am. Mm. Oh, let me just whiz this down here and I'll say my goodbyes. Take care. Goodbye, Kim. Kim, our gardener Kim and and Kim, Kim P. Oh, goodbye. Goodbye, Sandy. Take care. We love the crunch crunch sound, don't you, Sylvia? Bye, Kelly S. Take care. Mm. Yes, Nydia. As soon as the video's finished, I will put them on my community tab 
and underneath in the video description. Give me half an hour and I really will do that, Nidia. Definitely. I'm sorry you got a call. I hope you get more time to relax again later. Take care, Heather. Heather, um, keep safe. And I hope that for you and your community, things start to get a little bit more back to normal. Bye-bye, mm. Barbara. And thank you for reminding me about it was teapot, Mrs. Teapot time, Barbara. I lost track of time. Mm. Susan says, the nice thing is that listing your positive attributes gets easier with practice. Yes, it's a practice. It's something that one could practice daily or weekly, no pressure. Definitely. Yes, definitely. Mm. And we, we don't have to share it with anybody either. It can be just for us. We could share it. Yes. Mm. Mm, take care, Dar. So nice to see you. Take care. Um, care. <laughs> I'm sorry, I've been calling you Kerr and Care. Uh, you know me. I uh, apologise. Goodbye, Care. Take care on the lake. Mm, butterfly creations. I look forward to um, messaging with talking to your messenger and finding out your, your, your Christian name, yes. Mm, take care. Have a lovely time in the garden, Kimberly. Bye, Nydia. Bye, Kelly S. and Sylvia. Take good care. And Sandy. Mm. Bye, Colleen. <laughs> oh. Bye, Cheryl. Take care. Bye. Mm. Bye, Susan M. Mm. Nice, nice to see you. Bye, Melissa too. Melissa Sue. Ah, oh, just learn to observe, mm, to watch. Yes, yes, true. Mm. That's to, to be have times of stillness. Yeah, that's a pleasure, Lisa. So nice to see you, and I'm glad that you've been finding your inner child. Yes, take care, Caroline. Mm. Bye, Lynn. Mm. Oh, I hope your week's not as busy this week. It's another busy week. Bye, bye, Cheryl, dear. Mm. Well, I better put the phone down, haven't I? It's time for me to put the phone down. And nip over to Rebecca if you want to. Um, we'll pop the link. Someone may put the link in the chat. But create with Rebecca, and she's having a sale, so you might want to pop over and see her. Um, bye, darling. Take care. It's been a pleasure been a pleasure and I need to say goodbye to the replayers goodbye replayers you're so valued thank you for your time and for being with us and gentle listeners goodbye and I I do hope that you have a week where you get a little bit of time to yourself because you might be working hard or you might be in a lot of pain and I do hope that as the week goes on, that it gets a little bit better for you. Take care. Bye, Patty. Hmm. Take care. I'll pop the phone down. No, you put the phone down. No, I'll put the phone down. <laughs> Take care, everyone.